She is one of the most powerful women in the world at the moment so whatever she says does have an impact, Indian social entrepreneur Nishita Men reportedly said. And a new report out Wednesday suggests that Ivanx's power may extend beyond her presence abroad. The New York Times reported that her father initially wanted Combine to repeal the so-called Obamacare mandate requiring Americans to have health insurance and use the savings to cut the tax rate paid by the richest Americans, a move that would have benefited him. Ivanxa reportedly teamed up with her allies in the Senate to instead expand a child tax credit. During the summit in India, she focused her comments on opening more employment opportunities for women. We are half the population so we need to start thinking about them as critical issues, she said. Forbes recently placed her at number 19 on its 2017 World's Most Powerful Women list. The praise and high-profile role comes in contrast to new reports out about the First Lady suggesting she was not interested in her role in the White House. Melania Trump criticized liberal media following the report. Once again part of the liberal media, this time Vanity Fair, has written a story riddled with unnamed sources and false assertions, the First Lady said in a statement issued by her spokeswoman. As a magazine tailored to women it is shameful that they continue to write salacious and false stories meant to demean Mrs. Trump, rather than focus on her positive work as First Lady and a supportive wife and mother. As has been stated on the record many times before, she is honored by her role.